this is Super Happy Minecrafters, John Honey 633, and welcome to a new video. So, today was a day that I was supposed to make a video with Kelly, but Kelly isn't here. Um, yeah, she's not here. But, anyway, um, I am going to be making some hand sanitizer. So, I'm just testing this, so. <laughs> I have a little cup here. Vaseline. And some shampoo. This is water smelling shampoo, so. Watermelon smelling shampoo, so it smell pretty good. And it has water. So let's just start by filling up with like a little bit of water. You never want, you never want a lot of, oh, 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 oh. You never want a lot of water. And we're just gonna add a little bit of the um, shampoo. And I'm just putting a small amount because, yeah, and then Q-tip with some Vaseline, mix it around, just to kind of get that in there. And I'm just thinking of things that would like make it like a little bit more chunkier. Um, and... Uh, I used to do this all the time. I also remember hand soap. Uh, but you don't really like a lot of hand soap. Never put a lot of hand soap in there. Because then it gets too soapy. Can add a little bit more of shampoo. And probably already told you this, but we're making hand sanitizer. This is kind of like what it's looking like right now. Uh, when we get it over the top. So yeah, um, this is kind of a, this is like the consistency. Very jelly. Yeah. So um, probably gonna take a little scoop of Vaseline. Take this out and then I just stick it like right there in the last one. And just put a blob of Vaseline in there. And next thing is just add a lot, take some Vaseline. And this, like, hand sanitizer will really help with your hands. Um, it will make them smell good with the shampoo. Um, it will make them, um, <clears throat> like if you rub this around your hands, it will um, make your <clears throat> hands not dry because of, <laughs> because of the Vaseline. So, it's kind of what it's looking like right now. Um, Definitely need some more water. It kind of makes my finger do that. Like this is more of a hand soap. Um, is what it's really turning out to be. We got a hand sanitizer because hand sanitizer is very hard to make. It's a lot of chemicals that get it to that consistency. So this is really just some hand soap. Um, and I realized when I was, um, when I was, um, just entering my finger into the water, it did, um, have a Vaseline thing. Um, and if you don't know what Vaseline is, really to just, um, 
It temporarily protects cuts, minor cuts, scrapes, burns, temporarily and protects elderly, chapped, or cracked skin and lips. So, if you rub this on your lips, you would also do that. Um, and there's really a lot of chunks of Vaseline. So, I'm probably going to have to get in there. And do that. And I'm also going to add a little bit of weight down. <gasps> that could have gone a lot worse. Like really, this whole thing just fell, but like this this isn't really coming out. So, um I'm gonna add a little bit more water. Just because you always need, oh gosh, you always need water in here. So now I'm just going to mix it up and it's looking pretty good. We haven't done much of a consistency check. I haven't done a consistency check with you for a while. So I'm going to do that again. It still needs a little bit more water. There we go. That should be snappy. Uh, most things have water in them, so. And you're actually using water when you use this. You need water for this. And there's probably going to be some cat hairs in here from my cats. So, it's pretty much done. Um, the consistency. Kind of like a normal nail soap. Um, but a little bit, um, something else. Like, yeah. So I'm just gonna add a little, like, drop like that. Now, this is looking pretty cool. So it's very pink. It's a bubble gum ish. It's foamy. It's like a bubble gum latte. Let's just continue to mix that freshly added shampoo. Whenever I add shampoo, I feel like I need to add a little bit of water to it as well. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, man, I am. Um, I've tried making stuff like this before. Yeah, so this consistency is not to standards. We have to add a little bit more Vaseline. And this is probably going to be like the last ingredient. And then, yeah, so I'm just going to wipe it off the Q-tip and then mix the Q-tip around. Because, yeah. And while I'm mixing this around, um, Basically, um, today was supposed to be a Kelly video. Um, I was supposed to do a video with Kelly. So, as you can see so far, my schedule is not sticking out to that. But as soon as I get into it, like, we have a spider in our basement apparently, says Kelly. So, it is kind of scary to be in. Basement. And she said it was like really big. And yeah. So. And also, Kelly has been out like of the house for a while today. She just had hockey practice. She had another hockey thing. And now she is doing her homework. So, yeah, and pretty soon, um, probably tomorrow, I'm going to be doing a comment review of all of the comments. Yeah, I've been getting it a lot for a while. Um, 
And if you have seen <clears throat> the video I did with Kelly um, starting this kind of schedule thing, um, the night that the schedule video came out, um, you would have saw the blind drawing contest, which, which, um, I realized it was the Minecraft theme one, um, it was, it turned out, um, to cut it off, so, it kind of, yeah. Pretty sure some of the Q-tip just fell on there, so. Probably a sign of it. Just making a complete mess. So once again, I'm gonna go over the ingredients of this and some things that you eat. And then the rest is kind of up to you. So you're going to need some shampoo, how, whatever you like. Um, I use watermelon, Vaseline or anything to make this like thicker. I don't know what else you could use, but you could use something else. A little bit of hand soap, just a little bit. Um, you could also use some like this dry skin stuff, this kind of stick, so you could also add it in. Any like hand lotions, like from Justice or whatever, I don't know. Kelly used to have a load of those hand lotions. Um, you can put whatever you want in there. Yeah, and water in a little cup for something to put in. So let's do the first testing. Which that was a lot. Um, first of all, I'm just going to do a quick little consistency check. So, um, I didn't really take my time with this one. Um, so there was a couple of glunks of Vaseline. And, ooh, it's, it's, so this is how it's looking with my soap. And I'm going to use hand soap. And... It does smell like if you put a shampoo in there, it, your hands will smell like that, and that's really cool. I like watermelon, so that's really good to have watermelon, watermelon, smelling, watermelon smelling hands. So, I mean, in the way the reason the reason I chose um, shampoo was because. You know, when you kind of rub it in your hair, it turns like white and soap turns white and it's, they're like white. And I know this is for hair, but this is a three in one <laughs> shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. So, yeah, let's see how easily it comes off. It comes off pretty well. I went on. still here um i'm just gonna check for any clunks that were still left and none so um yeah i still have some soap left um let me just wash it down turn that off and then we're going to use the lovely hand soap and like they have like Water, I mean, who has water? They have sulfates, some profils, the sodium chlorides, all these chemicals. If you get this, so it's like a gelatin kind of, but there's this very watery consistency for the one that, it, that, that I'm using. 
but it seems watery, but jelly, <laughs> jelly, jello seems very watery. Oh, did you see that? It, it turns white right away, like mine. So there's some things in common. Um, it cleans and moisturizes is the one I guess. And this smells and cleans kind of and washes and moisturizes. So but we also put a little bit of this hand soap in here. So there's gonna be some pretty similarities. No berries, so I'm gonna use that glass for some sake. Well, it's not very vaseline chunky. Or chunks of vaseline. Oh god. It just turned into a complete mess. So, while I'm cleaning up here, um, I'm going to talk to you. Okay, so what I wanted to talk to you about is that I will be doing more like sciencey things on the channel. Like I will be doing more of like science experiments, maybe more creations. Okay, everyone, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye!